Welcome of UFC Unlimited Fight Channel. Coming up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. This is about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive these into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Our tail of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters with similar height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening and when the action begins our referee in charge Eve Loving and now this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 158 pounds. Fighting out of Minneapolis, Minnesota, big. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Good stick. Oh, hard work pays off. Lands the Superman punch flush. Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one-two punch there by Lee. Oh, slips the offering there and then rips back at the target. Boom! Head kick. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. He landed the right hand there. 
three minutes. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. Now connects with a right. Lee going for the head kick. He misses there. Oh, and he caught the kick. Lee's hook to the body appeared to be blocked by the defense. Under two minutes now to go in round one. Slips the punch. Trying to land the elbow there to no avail. A big call for punch land. Now he gets back in range. Kick to the body by Lee. That right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes him stop throwing. Oh, look at that jab. Snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast, and he always brings his hand right back to his face. Twenty seconds left. Like he might have landed there instead. A swing and a miss by Lee. <laughs> Round two next. All right, now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills, unbelievable striking. All right, DC, second round is getting underway. Round one, not the round of the year necessarily, but some good here. And it's not always going to be. You have two very talented fighters. Sometimes it's very even. That's what we saw in round number one. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Lee's head kick looked like that one was blocked. Big knee to the body. Yeah. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab. Right hand hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. We march on three minutes to go. Oh, and now he lands the knee. I'm not sure his opponent saw that coming. He didn't see it coming because he does such a great job of just throwing. He doesn't have any tell when he's going to throw a knee. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Oh, big left hook there. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Try to establish that jab. Nice defense there. Huge block. Nice straight punch. Cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Ooh, head kick lands with her. 
And he counters with a left hand. I mean, look at the fit of the kick in this fight. Look at him chop of the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Ten minutes in the books. All right, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1 level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are gonna really start to take their toll. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. He blocks the shot. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Check these low leg kicks. Good work. Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body, really starting to connect at will when it comes to work in the body, and especially effective doing it later in this fight. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. Well, he can. Oh! Just reached the midway point of the fight. Lee's attempting to pass here, but he's denied by the defense. All right, so you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Counters with the left hook. Nicely done there. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Oh, shot to the body connects there. He hasn't really thrown too many body strikes in this fight, but now, as this fight goes on, he is not discriminating, working the body, and those shots are gonna count. Offensive fight, nice job to block the shot there. Trying to establish that jab once again. Great punch landed with so much power. Make sure you don't eat too many more. You cannot eat too many. You gotta get the elbow to the side, because otherwise he's gonna land one that's gonna shut everything down. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? Liver kick. If you take those kicks, you can shut your body off. Take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides, really. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Nice strike. There's no tell on that leg kick. Look at him 
drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body. Oh, a huge block there. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Big punch lands through the middle. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Obvious redness on the right side of his body. Looking to land the leg kick now. Just over three minutes now to go. Nice body kick. They heard him in the last round. Same exact one. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Right under the elbow, the body can land. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Strong straight left there. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Oh, here's a kick to the body. Blocked, though, by Lee. <laughs> nice right hand. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Beautiful punch. I'm not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been pissed. Whoa! Oh, he might be out. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, straight right. Big body. Nice one, two there. Illustrator for the champ tonight, but that's okay. He'll still talk you through the replays. Body kicks for days, man. I mean, body kicks for days, but I gotta be honest, John. If we don't incorporate a Telestrator <laughs> into this game, this may be my only version of EA UFC. You ready? You ready? So here it is, folks. Fifth and final round. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is... Oh! oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. That was stuck in. Nice strike. Oh, nice right in. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Man, the body work continues to be a factor here. Look at the size of that bruise on his body. Well, he's up, but he is hoping for certain the finish could come at any time. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his Oh, he might be out. He went high to that one. Switching stances here. Under two minutes to go in the fight. Lee 
His attempt there is blocked by the opponent. Oh, he's hurt. He tears him up. We'll get him. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Well, you see all the grappling repetitions here. Just beautiful movement, seamless transitions on the ground. Over and over, these guys are doing things that you see in every jiu-jitsu gym around the country. 20 seconds to go in the fight. A real sneak by the Blocks the shot. Ooh, side kick, well timed there. Like the official decision is in. Yes, here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 50 45, 49 46, and 50 45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, nice job by him there as he is your winner via unanimous decision. And sometimes I would think it's easier said than done to just leave the judges out of it. Dominant performance and he gets his hand raised. Yeah, and if you've got to go to the judges, leave no question, right? Be the person that is so dominant that you know you're getting your hand raised. He did exactly.